Good morning, welcome to Waking with the Word. We have a famous scripture this morning. It is Deuteronomy 32 verse 4. It says, The rock, his work is perfect, for all his ways are just, a God of faithfulness, and without injustice, righteous and upright is he. The rock means the strength, and he can be my strength. And he can be your strength. Where you have no strength, the rock can be our strength. Why? Because his work, which means his actions, his deeds, are perfect. And that word perfect actually means blameless. If I entrust a situation to him, I don't have to worry about it. I'm not saying I won't, because as humans, we often do. But we need to get into the habit in our minds of saying, stop worrying, because I don't have to worry, because the way he works is always blameless. When I take a situation into my own hands, I am tempted to do things, to manipulate, to try and sort things out so they work out the way I want them, and I am often not innocent. I can either cause myself to be not innocent or other people to be not innocent. But when he works, it's blameless. God will work things out for our best. And he will work things out in such a way that we are not blamed for any outcome that happens. For all his ways are just. And the word ways actually means a journey. So in other words, the journey that God takes, that journey is just, which means to be right. He makes correct judgments because he can see the full situation. He can see everybody's intentions. We often say, I know what you're thinking, or you did this because, but actually, we don't know what anyone's thinking. And we know no reason, really, why people do what they do, but he does. And so he, our father, can be a strength to us because everything he does is blameless. And the journey he takes to do what he's going to do will be the correct one at every single turn. Why? Because he is a God of faithfulness, which means steadfastness, a God of stability. That word faithfulness means steadfast and stable. He is the most stable person, character, individual, entity and being that any of us could ever be in contact with. Thank God that he is, because everybody that walks this earth is unstable in some way or another, because they do not see everything. We see through a glass dimly. This is why Jesus said on the cross, forgive them, for they don't even know what they're doing. But God does, and he is always stable, and he is always ready to be our rock. Without injustice, he has no desire to manipulate at all. He has no desire to control. He is a God that allows us to make our own way and our own mistakes. Righteous and upright is he. Our God is waiting for us to cast our care into his hands so that he can take that care and he can sort our situations and be our strength without us having to be blamed and so that he can do everything in a way that is just and fair and good. God is transparent and he is upright, and he is stable, and he is here for you and me today. 
The word upright can also mean proposal of peace. In other words, he does everything in peace. Perhaps my life today is not very peaceful. Perhaps your life today is turmoil, stress, anxiety and pressure. Perhaps life seems very unstable. The rock says in James, when you draw near to me, I will draw near to you. Sit today, just sit and ask the Holy Spirit to come and fill you afresh and fill you anew with the strength that comes from the one who can deal with all of our situations and do it blamelessly. And ask the Lord for patience today because he doesn't always move quickly. He moves at just the right time. That's not always our time. If you need prayer, send us a message. God bless.